How constipation affects your colon and health. 70% or more of the population struggles with constipation. Some believe the number is even higher, 80 to 90%. The market for laxatives is now approaching 1 billion each year. It appears that constipation is an issue that most of us have to deal with at one time or the other. I believe that to have good health we need to use mostly foods and supplements that are free of additives and food enhancers that are harmful to the body. We need to eat the right foods and watch how we prepare them so we can digest and absorb them without creating or leaving residues that get turned into toxic matter in our colon. The first question that a nutritionist or any other health practitioner should ask you on your first visit is, how many bowel movements do you have each day or each week? If you visit a doctor, your colon is the last area they discuss with you. And perhaps, this is an area they may never discuss with you at all. Without good regular bowel movements and colon function, you will create various illnesses, colon discomforts, and diseases, including constipation. By concentrating on eliminating constipation and preserving colon health, you can take a major step in preventing many body conditions and illnesses that can shorten your life or make your senior years a miserable time. As with so many past health practitioners, I believe your colon is so important that any improvement you can make in your colon's health will help you avert many unnecessary illnesses and suffering. If you make only one effort in improving your health, it should be towards creating a clean and healthy colon. Heart attacks, cancers, senility, pathogenic organisms and so on cause most deaths that occur in the US and throughout the world. There are few deaths related to natural causes or old age. Your colon provides nutrients and water to all parts of the body. So, when a specific organ has degenerated it is important to see what part colon toxins have played in this degeneration. If your colon is toxic, the blood will also be toxic. If your colon is toxic, these toxins will gradually reach all parts of your body through the blood and lymph liquid. The result is the body and various organs affected will become less efficient. Over time this decreased efficiency will cause the body will become diseased and you will lose your good health. If you like the video give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends, or anyone who would benefit from the video and remember to click the subscribe button. Thank you.